Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome to another Let's Go to Work episode, the Steve the Gamer edition, of course. I still can't believe I'm playing as me, though. But right now, we're just starting our day. Um, one of the jobs I saw you guys enjoy last time was the bus driver job. So we might try to do that today. It's a nice Sunday. You know, why not? And also, we have to drop off the Rolls Royce to his other location. This guy just owns so many locations. Man, I feel like we live here now. We definitely live here, bro. But um, yeah, so let's go drop this uh, Rolls Royce to the other location. Uh, we'll pick up some of you guys did request for me to drive like a G wagon or something like that because we've been driving like the supercars and you know the GTRs and stuff like that. So let's take this Rolls Royce. Let me move the Ferrari real quick. Gonna move the Ferrari and get the Rolls Royce out of here. And I guess today is gonna be a G wagon day in the bus. <laughs> So we'll see how that's gonna turn out. All right, let's hurry up. And the time, as you guys can see, I let the time go so we can actually see like how much can we get done throughout the day. Talking about GTA 5 time, man. All right, so we're taking this. We're gonna bring it to the mansion. Um, let me actually cut through here. Got to bring that Ferrari back. We're gonna put the Ferrari inside then. Man. When it comes to let's go to work, man, it, it definitely hit different, and and just just the time that I took to just you know install almost everything from the car sounds to all that stuff, man. Yeah, it it takes time. You just got to be patient. I kind of wish like they sell like a pack where you can actually put everything. Like the other day, like I saw um, modding ATS, and it was so easy, bro. It was like click, click, clear, click there. What? <laughs> yo, yo, where that just came from right now? Oh, she was on the phone. Wow. All right, we're just gonna mind our business. We're just gonna mind our business. All right, so we gotta go back to the Chris house. Not my house, but his house. But it is what it is. All right, so we're bringing this back. Once we uh, get there, we'll take the G wagon, and then we should be all set. Wait, why they got me going all these routes? Wait, I'm going right over there. Yes, man. <laughs> I guess that's about right. <laughs> I'll do it as long as I get there. I, I, I mean, this look like that's the fastest route possible, so we'll see. But and also, I hope you guys been enjoying these type of graphics, man. I'm trying my best to like as far as improving and just trying to get the thing that uh, at least the game to run well, but when it comes to the game, man, you guys already know how glitchy GTA can actually be. Can make it. There you go. We almost hit a Ferrari. Oops. Now nah, this is reckless driving, <laughs> but we be trying our best, man, to just make sure we get there fast. Because uh, especially right now it's eight o'clock, and I want to do a bus route. By the time we get there, I hope it's not gonna be like a night shift or something like that. But um, yeah, so just like I said, we dropping this. Oh, whoa, whoa, that ain't my car, man. Let me see things like that happen when you're not driving your car. Like, this is why I don't drive nobody else's car, bro. Like, I don't know how did I do it before. I guess because I I don't know. I, I, I just can't do it today. If it ain't my car, I am not driving it unless like I'm out of town and I need to pick up a rental or something like that. But if it's like me out of nowhere and say, oh, can I borrow your nah, bro, I can't do it. I can't do it. Like, it's got to be like the last resort for me to do it. But right now we're trying to hurry up, trying to make it to that mansion. Oh, by the way, this the top of this um, Rolls Royce actually go up too, man. Right? It's not like we have to like press a lot of buttons. It's just one button and this thing actually go up. Oh, I thought that was the cops. All right, and I also figured out a way not to make this thing stutter anymore, man. You see how when I usually pull up to the to this to this house right here, it used to like stutter like extremely. Now I kind of like unlock some of the memories, man. Man, GTA GTA Five come a long way, like for real, man. For real, for real. All right, but we here. Let's park this right here. <laughs> Now nah, that's nice. Now nah, that's nice, bro. Somebody look at this. 
All right. When was the last time you guys seen this property? I know some of you guys has been keeping up with the episodes. If this is your first episode, bro, I mean, let's just take a glimpse real quick. Word, word. When you walk in, you know. I mean, I just want to show you guys the view of outside. Wait, wasn't that wasn't that the movie theater? Yep. As you guys can see. And now, now that's a mansion, bro. That's a mansion right here. Can I walk outside from here? Yes, I can. Yeah, look at this view, bro. Look at and this dude's never home. <laughs> It'd be like that though. People that own mansion like that, they never home. Now look at this view, bro. Now that's a view. That's what I'm talking about. All right, but anyway, enough about that. Let's go. Let's go. We need to just grab the G wagon and go because I got a bus route to do today. And just like I say, I pick a different route today, and uh, we'll see, man. Last route was pretty cool. This one should be fun too. Uh, the G wagon was on this side right here. We got a chance to drive any cars we like, man. All right, so let's take this. Oh, I might have to unlock it with Mania. Yeah, I forgot all his doors are locked, bro. All right, so we using Mania right now. I show you guys didn't see that. And uh, let's get the doors unlock, and also for the vehicle not to be frozen in place. All right, you wagon. Let's go. Don't my G wagon. First time I drove a G wagon, like for real. I mean, I drove one in the parking lot. wasn't that impressive, but um, I really got uh, what's what's that company name? Cloud Nine. Cloud Nine Exotic got me into G wagon. That's how I ended up buying one in real life, of course. Uh, I was in New York. They didn't have no more cars left. Whenever I'm in New York, they the one that hooked me up with cars. Like you, you'll be seeing me driving supercars and stuff like that from Ferraris to Lambos. Whenever I'm in New York, they my hook up. And uh, they didn't have no cars left because I wanted the Lambo. That like that was gonna be my first time like you know chilling in the Ventador and stuff like that. But they didn't have it. They didn't have any other cars that was worth driving. And then they told me to you know. Since they don't have no cars, why not just take the G wagon? They gave they gave it to me like almost half price too, and I was you know I was like whatever, I'll take it. I was you know I, I didn't I didn't like the G wagon like that. I was new to it, but man, man, it was a different experience. It was definitely a different experience. That's how I end up I end up buying one too. <laughs> I was like yo, all right, all right. The Urus is cool though. The Urus is cool. The Urus just remind me of an Audi so much to the point where it's like ah. Uh, I don't know. That's just me. That is just me. All right, so guys, the route that we're doing right now. So we did uh, last time we did this route right here. I'm trying to do this route over here. I don't know what route is that, but um, that's like right there by that gas station. Oh, she sound good too, man. That's your, oh, actually, the interior of this G wagon is on point. Oh, boy, yo. Yo, yo, people be doing that in real life, though. Oh, man, I know I'll be I'll be <sighs> like you guys be thinking NPCs all bad drivers, man. They got some people in real life that they are like really bad drivers, bro, like for real, for real. But um, yeah, that was that was I, I, I thought I lost the G wagon for a second right here. We just got cut off badly, bro. Oh shoot! Oh shoot! That was close. Oh yo! How how you just stop? And this is why I get man. You gotta watch out for all these other drivers, man. That's why being a good driver is just being able to like not let anybody crash into you. Because sometimes you be thinking like, yeah, I'm I'm gonna crash into that person, but uh, it's really the other drivers you gotta watch out for, man. Especially doing that, say uh, that's gonna say to you like, yo, I didn't even see you. Yeah, you didn't see me because you didn't use your mirrors. And some people, you know, some people don't use their side mirrors. I just don't. I just can't believe that, man. I mean, I had to learn how to drive without it, but 
just I mean even my side mirrors, even though when I use them, I still turn my head. I don't know if some of you guys do that too. Whoa. That was my fault. That was really my fault. How bad was it? We good, we good. That was my fault. I, I mean I just straight up took a red light. I <laughs> show you guys didn't see that. There was no time to avoid them. I stopped, but there was no time. This is why you shouldn't take red light in real life. Yo, that was crazy, man. But yeah, it's crazy how some people do not use their mirrors at all, man. I had to learn how to not use my mirrors because driving trucks, there's certain trucks that don't have like that, especially the entire mirrors. All right, we're going to park right here. I'll park in. The, no, no, actually, I want to park in front of the camera. When you park, like thinking like you parking in the back, like you say, like you, your car is safer that way. No, sir. You want to park like right in front of the camera. The camera is looking all the way over here. All right, so come on. Bus route. Let's see. I bet we're going to be around Davis. We got beef around Davis, though, bro. All right, so that's our job for this Sunday, guys. I hope you guys are going to enjoy this. All right, reporting for work. All right, so this is Strawberry. 520 Strawberry. Route started, drive to the first stop. All right, come on. Let's go. I hope you guys are going to enjoy this. And definitely a big shout out to all the MTA drivers out there. The CT, I think it's CTA for Chicago or something like that. All the bus drivers out there, man. I know each each state's got a got a name for it, of course. I'm used to the MTA. <laughs> you guys already know how we do in New York, man. All right. We ready to pick up everybody. Let me stop at the bus stop. Come on, people. This is Adam Apple Boulevard. I stopped too close to the oh, oh I got it, I got it. All right, come on, people. Hey. That's not a bad route though. Strawberry. Just like I say, I'm not following um traffic as far as traffic rules is just not stopping. We just gotta keep moving. That's it. That's that's the only thing I'm not doing, like stopping. Stopping for like red lights, or yellow light or something like that. Wait, did it just turn yellow and green and okay, yeah, I didn't see that. Alright, somebody just got off. Alright, mad people coming in. Alright, come on, people. Yo, what's up? What's up? That it? Everybody's sitting? Yeah, I swear the driver don't be waiting for you to sit. <laughs> Yo, talk about story time, bro. Oh my goodness, bro. That was that was so embarrassing. So I oh man. I remember this. Like um you see, this is why story time always get triggered that way too. So uh, Florida, Florida. I had to take the bus all the time because I I never own a car in Florida when I used to live in Florida. This is a uh, oh wrong bus stop, wrong bus stop, bro. All right, this is the right bus stop. Yeah, so Florida. Uh, this girl that used to um, so we start dated, we start dating or whatever. She used to be like one stop before my stop, you know. So whenever we coming out of school, we just get on the bus together. But um, talking about embarrassing, bro. She got in. She got in because I was, you know, you, you, the bus driver make sure you got enough change or to, to pay for the bus. So I let her let her go in and sit. But um, as soon as I finished pay, because I was taking so long to pay, bro, because I didn't, I don't remember how much we used to pay. I remember in New York used to be like what one twenty five or something like that. I'm pretty sure it's not that anymore. But um. As soon as I pay, you know, the bus don't wait for you to just, you know, to sit down. You know, they just kept moving. I fell on my face, bro. I fell on my face. People were actually laughing. <laughs> they were laughing on the bus because, yo, the way I felt, it was like a clumsy fall. Like, you, you know, you know, when you fall like that, like, yo, how can I fall like this, bro? Like, somebody step on my lace it, and <laughs> I fell straight up. No miss, like my face actually hit the floor on the bus, bro. That was that was embarrassing. 
<laughs> he was even laughing at me, bro. I was like, man, I wanted to get off the bus, bro. <laughs> I wanted to walk home. <laughs> that's that's what type of fall it was, bro. I I can't believe I remember that too. And you know what? Another another reason why I could say like it was, it was a crazy fall because it was raining that day too, man. It was raining that day. That was just crazy. Are we here? We good? Come on, people. That's not a bad route, guys. I thought this was gonna take us to like Davis and stuff like that. What's up? This is a cool route. But I'm guessing once we get down there, uh, we're gonna have to turn around. It's already like two o'clock, bro. I mean, that time is flying in GTA, bro. But that's a nice route. But any bus driver that actually watched my episodes, let me know, man. I know you guys do a like different type of jobs, and this is why I always like when it comes to let's go to work. I mean, I had my experience. I know some of you guys probably like whatever job that you do. Let me know, man. Let me know what do you guys do for a living? At least, um, are you a driver? Are you? I mean, working in the office? Let me know, man. But like, I've done so much things. I didn't do everything, but I've done a lot of jobs, especially in New York. New York kind of introduced you to a lot of jobs, yo. It's just what you want to do, which one you can actually keep too. <laughs> but right now, let's hurry up. Next bus stop. And I don't want to crash with these customers either. See, I'm just being careful though. Might left the door open. All right, so we here. I would have been a good bus driver, bro. Definitely would have been. A good bus driver. Come on. Come on, man. All right, but other than that, how's you guys Sunday going, man? I hope you guys are having a great Sunday or whenever you guys are watching this, of course. Uh, that's why it's GTA, man. No, I was I was just about to do a tutorial, bro. We got a rock. We got a rock star update. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna hold on. I'm gonna hold on to that until we're ready. I have to stop for this one. Oh, I forgot there's a there's a place over here. I gotta go check out that place soon too. Maybe we'll do that after. Another mansion we haven't seen in a while. Alright, this is a bus stop right here. Is it back here? I don't remember. Yo, there's a hotel over here? I totally forgot about that too. Please don't hit me. This is a pretty cool route, guys. I mean, we could sightseeing with this route right here. Last time I went to LA, I saw this view. Oh man, sometimes I, I I sit back and think about like, yo, we really just I'm kind of like living in LA right now, bro. <laughs> when you play GTA, I'm pretty sure anybody that live in LA like know some of these areas, especially this one right here. When you get down there. Oh, shoot, shoot. Thank you. Thank you for not hitting me. But yeah, man. That was one place I wanted to live, and I just never would move to the West Coast, though, man. I mean, I mean, on the West Coast all the time, like, especially for, like, stuff that I usually do with, like, YouTube and stuff like that. But just never, never lived there, bro. Hey, baby. What took you so long to call? Yeah, let's go. I'm talking about that um last invite that I was. Um, Yo. I was in LA for Warner's Brothers. Should definitely big shout out to them. It's been a while, man. <laughs> it's been a while since I I did like any um stuff like that. But I'll be in New York this month. Um it's a it's a private event. I wish I could invite you guys. But it's a private event where um I'm going to some of you guys school. But I mean, yeah, it's going to be private cuz it's only open to like the students. So um, yeah, I'll get a chance to speak to some of you guys. Uh, we might. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. It just depends on how the event is gonna turn out. But I'm definitely looking forward to you know stuff like that. Of course, I'll get a chance to like you know speak to some of you guys, man. That usually watch my episode. Come on, man. Bacon triple cheese melt. <laughs> Yo, that actually looked delicious though. Whoa. Yo. Oh man, he mad. He called her four times, bro. You know he mad. 
All right. At least we wait for the uh, people to. Oh, okay. I think we're returning now. At least we wait for the people to um, get on the bus. What about if I get out the the bus? Do I fail the mission? Can I take a break? You know, that's one thing I'd be wondering. Do the bus drivers get a break like in the middle of the route? <laughs> I've seen some bus uh, drivers stop, but I don't know. Uh, in other words, can you take a break while you have people? <laughs> I'm pretty sure you can. Pretty sure you can. I've been kicked off buses though, man. I remember um Man, that was a long time ago though. That was that was like high school days where um a couple of my friends got into a fight and uh, we all got kicked off the bus. I was so pissed, man. All right, so let's go. Nobody's getting on. This is actually a cool route, guys. This is a cool route, and you get to pass by the beach too. Yeah, hey. nice ocean. Wait, wait, are we going down by the beach though? Yeah, it looked like we are. This, I mean, this seems like a long route too. Seems like we're gonna be doing that night shift over here too. By the time we get there, it's gonna be like nighttime. All right. You see, this is this car. It, this car should get towed, bro. How you blocking the bus stop, man? My bad, dude. You see, he was he was blocking the bus stop, man. You good? Yo, what's up? All right. All right. Yeah, I would I wouldn't mind doing this route. We get we get a chance to pass by the water, like we chilling. Like I would have definitely picked to take my break somewhere around here, for sure. <laughs> I take a break, sightseeing for a little bit. Yeah, we get to like, yo, drive on a beach. All right, that's not bad. That is not a bad route. Cruising. Are you on, bro? All right. Oh, we got to turn now. All right. I mean, that was that was a nice route. That was definitely a nice route. I know I'm gonna keep saying that. <laughs> I didn't expect like we was we was gonna come down here because it did say just strawberry. We start around strawberry and then come all the way down here. But this is this is definitely a cool route. I mean, I'll get a chance to do all the routes, and you guys let me know which one is better. I didn't like the tour bus route though. That was that was not a great experience, bro. <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna do that job again. And another thing with that job, I don't know for some reason it just kept crashing too. So hopefully I don't have to do that job again. All right. And some of you guys have been asking for me to start doing GTA again with the wheel. I think I, I mean I got GTA on that other PC now, so we'll see. It's just a matter of getting that wheel to work because I remember it used to be my other wheel that work. The Fnatic. Let's see. I mean it should work though. It should be any wheels, but um, the they have settings for the G29. And also the whoa 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 whoa. I feel like you I'd be avoiding people like that in real life, man. Yo, this there was this guy the other day, just I don't know. I don't know what was he thinking. Or maybe he was drunk. That's the only thing I could think of. Maybe he was drunk. You guys know I drive every day, so I get into in some type of encounter with somebody. But um every day. But um this guy was just driving and uh you know we we have two lanes. And he just swerved straight into my lane, like straight up, swerving into my lane. Like I'm happy I caught it. You don't be seeing like when you could feel like something is getting close to you. So yeah, he swerved straight up into my lane, and I I stopped at the right time because he, he kind of like merged into my lane. Is that it? We good? Yeah, we had we had him back now. Yeah, man. That's what I mean. That's what a good driver is for me. Being able to avoid. Any accident, bro. I mean, you can't avoid every, but um, most of the accidents, like I try to avoid. Even the story time that I told you guys about this lady that flipped on the highway, bro. I don't know how she did that. I had to stop, but I had my son with me, so I couldn't like leave him in, in my in my car for too long. And I didn't want to like, you know, we on the highway, cars moving. 
that's like the most scariest thing. Like being on stop stopping on the highway, I avoid. Oh shoot! I just passed the bus stop, bro. Oh man, this is what happened when you talking. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. I just passed the bus stop. I hope nobody's coming. Hope nobody's coming. Oh, okay, we just passed the bus stop, bro. <laughs> okay, that works. Yeah, it's just like I was saying, man. I had my son in the car, so I'll, I make sure she she got some help, and uh, I just kept it moving. And she did get some help. There was another guy that was willing to stay with her too, because I was like, yo. I got my son in the car. I hate stopping on the, in the like on the highway. She was on the side. Her car flipped. Like I don't know how she crashed, bro. I I just down the sand. But I was like, you know, it is what it is. She needs some help. Right now, let's hurry up. This was a cool route. I would definitely do this again. Let me know if you guys been enjoying the um. I guess we playing bus simulator. <laughs> That's what this feel like. This is bus simulator, bro. Brought to you by Sleepy. Oh my goodness. Almost missed the bus stop again. <laughs> you guys didn't see that. You guys did not see that, bro. Cause I'm I'm in a hurry to get back, bro. And I'm pretty sure they're gonna bring us right back to that same um location. Which is cool. But the person that made this mod, I like the fact that they took their time. Like, I mean, do you guys enjoy this um job right here? I kind of wish like all the other job was like about the same way. Like, you know, like they had a cleaning job, which was pretty cool too. Um, they had um, the stock market job. That's pretty cool. I mean, we have jobs for days in GTA, man. Just, just go to work. And uh, right now we go into the next stop. I don't want to miss the next, the next stop again, bro. That was funny though how I missed the, that stop back there. All right, we almost at the last stop. Everybody's gonna have to get off, man. And one thing I realized, you know, the bus usually don't let you stay on uh, into the next stop because I remember, yo, they they get they got me off because I was like, yo, I took the bus on the wrong side. This guy's getting on. So um, I used to take the 44. The 44 used to be like the number one bus for me because I mean. If I miss it, forget it, bro. Forget it. Some of you guys, if definitely let me. Oh shoot, who's shooting? Oh, we right in front of the range, bro. Um, does anybody know what a 44 is? I mean, that's in New York. Oh shoot, the 44 used to be the bus that I have to take every day to go to work, bro. I'm talking about like right after school. I gotta hurry up. I gotta make sure I don't miss it. And if I miss it at night, I gotta wait for one more hour. Before it comes again, so is I used to get off work like at twelve o'clock. I think I told you guys that too. I used to get off work at twelve o'clock, so it, the bus usually passed like twelve, maybe twelve or five or something like that. And if I don't make it there, bro, it used to be the worst. And sometimes I used to think like that bus driver used to do me dirty, bro. If you if you don't see nobody at the bus, I I don't like when bus drivers does that, but you know it is what it is. If they don't see nobody at the bus stop. And they don't um, have nobody on the bus like that. They just zoom through. I'm like, come on, man. Nights nice that I missed that bus, bro. Yo, it used to be the worst. All right, so we did what we had to do with this one, guys. Last stop. That's it. We did what we had to do. Oh, it just kicked me off the bus. <laughs> All right, so let's grab the G wagon, guys. Um, uh, and let's get out of here. Yeah, I got a chance to drive this. I'm not racing this G. No, sir. No, sir. All right. So, um, yeah, just like I say, remember that location that I was telling you guys about? Let's go over there right now. I'm going to just hop on the highway. This ain't move, yo. I mean, my G Wagon be moving, though. <laughs> For real. You'd be surprised. You'd be thinking like, yo, you're driving a regular car for real. The way this thing pick up. Oh, yeah, that's that's one thing that's nerve wracking about the truck, though. Be feeling like you're gonna flip it. <laughs> but other than that, man, this is a nice truck. Um, should I? No, no, no. Actually, it's the next exit. Not this exit. Oh, uh, it's getting docked too. So let's make sure we do this. 
And uh, just like I said, man, hopefully you guys are going to enjoy today's episode. Um, I'm actually going to show you guys the last property that this guy owned. I don't know if it's still there, though, man. We're going to try if it's not there. You guys understand? But I, OK, it's the next exit right here. Yo, this truck is moving so fast. I think the graphic is trying to keep up with it <laughs> for real. Yep, it felt like that. All right, so where's the block? Um, is it right here? I think it might be right here. Yep, yep, that's it right here. All right. Um, this is another mansion. I think I showed you guys this a while back. But welcome. All right. I guess this mansion, since it's a wide map, is still low that way. And it kind of kills your FPS too, but um, yeah, I think you guys remember this. Oh, and the lights too. So this is not a bad spot, man. This is the gaming area. We got a little ball over here. We can actually throw a party downstairs, and you know nobody know what's going on upstairs, man. Got the kitchen. Oh, they can. Oh, it's all glass. It's all glass. They, they will see what's going. On. Yo, that's crazy. Yo, I yo, I came through here so many times. I don't remember this. This was all glass like this. I oh, man, I don't walk on glass like that. Oh, look at the bike. I remember this. That's a nice prop. Uh, and you can actually go on the balcony from right here. Got a nice little fireplace. Oh, you can actually see over here too. Wow, that's nice. Look at the moon. Actually, nice, bro. That's a nice little vibe right here. All right, let's go up. And uh, this guy can actually bring his own helicopter in town. Yep. We still got a nice view from up here, though. Oh yeah, this is definitely LA vibe. Look at the water, bro. All right, so enough with that. Was that the no no no, I think we might have one more floor to go to. And then we can actually get out of here. Just like I say, man, I hope you guys did enjoy today's episode. Don't yo yo <laughs> I thought I wasn't gonna make it. All right, one more floor and uh, we all set. And no, I don't get a chance to stay here. Should we stay here or the other house? What you guys think? The, yo, this is what my setup look like right now. <laughs> this is yo, look at the mic though. The, look at the news mic. Yo, this is exactly how my setup. I mean, not that much screen. I think minus two of those. But that's a lot. Definitely let me know what you guys think about this property though, man. This is a vibe though, man. And also over here, got kind of give me a, a, a Seattle vibe, aka Chicago also vibe, man. We got the shower running. Oh no, no, that's that's probably the fireplace we can actually hear right now. All right, but um, other than that, man, we are out of here. I hope you guys are going to enjoy today's episode. Another, let's go to work. You guys got a chance to chill with me, go on a job, bus driver, of course. Let me know what other job you guys want to see more often. So this is the second time we did the bus driver job. I mean, I really enjoyed it, especially this the route we, we just took right now. That was a pretty cool route, man. We got a chance to pass by the water and all that, man. That was not bad at all. But um, yeah, put in some requests. What other cars you guys want me to want me to drive? We got a chance to take the G wagon, not for long, but we got a chance to drive it today, man. It did the job. Let me see first person view. Oh, I forgot we got stars. We got stars, bro. Can't barely see in here. All right, but yeah, just like that, guys. I appreciate y'all. Have a great Sunday, or whenever you guys are watching this. Until next time, guys. Peace.